today we're going to build something awesome we will create any custom ui in chair in picture mode and by the end of this video we will also learn to implement a video player inside the pip mode so first we will add this floating package as a dependency so go ahead and open the pugspec.yml file and add it as a dependency and also make sure to add the video player which we will use later in this video then go to the android manifex.xml file and add this support picture in picture label and set it to true and that's all for the setup part now let's start with the implementation now here in this file i have created an aspect ratio list which contain the different aspect ratio for the pip mode and it also contain a stateful widget then inside the stateful widget create a floating variable then aspect ratio and give it a default value of aspect ratio list first element and lastly a bool variable to check if pip mode is available or not as pip is supported by android sdk 26 and above then inside the init state assign the floating variable to the floating constructor and call the request pip available function below it let's create the request pip available function in it set the its pip available to floating dot is pip available which check if the picture in picture is available on the device and then call a set state and then inside the dispose call the floating dot dispose method now it's time to build the ui so firstly add the pip switcher widget which comes from the floating package in it add when child enable which renders the ui for the pip mode now here we're gonna return a simple scaffold widget with an app bar and a body of column with a text widget then add when child disable which basically renders the ui in the normal mode now for the ui we're gonna return a scaffold widget with an app bar and a body of column in it we will add a text widget to show if the peep mode is available or not and then we will add a drop down button widget with a written type of list of ints in it give it a value of expect ratio and for the items we will use the expect ratio list specified and call a map method which returns the drop down menu item in it for any given value we will return a drop down menu list widget in it we will specify the value equal to the given value and a child with a text widget which basically displays the aspect ratio value at index 0 and 1 and lastly add to list then inside the on change callback we will check if the new value is null or else we will assign the aspect ratio to the new value and call the set state now here we gonna add an icon button which will trigger the picture in picture mode so give it an icon of picture in picture and inside the on press we will first check if the peep is available if it is then return a callback in which we call the floating dot enable method which take a rational constructor which require a numerator as well as a denominator which are basically our aspect ratios width and height so we will pass an aspect ratio at index 0 as a numerator and aspect ratio at index 1 as a denominator and now as we run this app we will see a drop down where we can change the aspect ratio and when we click on this icon button we trigger the picture in picture mode and we can see that the ui is similar to the one we have passed inside the child when enable property with this simple approach we can literally build any ui with any aspect ratio that we want to prove it let's start building the video player and by the way if you are enjoying this video then a sub would really be appreciated now here we have a simple stateful widget in it we will add a floating variable then a video player controller and inside the init state we will initialize the floating variable as well as a controller to video player controller dot network and give it a video url then call the initialize method with the cascading operator and once the video player controller is initialized then call controller dot set loop to true and controller dot lay and lastly call set state to render the first frame now below it we will create a method named just video and as the name suggests it will return just the video widget so inside it we will return an aspect ratio and give it an aspect ratio of 16 is to 9 and then give it a child of video player and pass it a video player controller and below it make sure to dispose of floating as well as the video player controller now inside the builder return a pip switcher widget now inside child when enable we will return just the video and for child when disable we will return a scaffold with a simple app bar and a body of center widget with a child of just video and to trigger the picture in picture we will add a floating action button add pip switcher widget with child when disable equal to the floating action button then add an on press callback in which we will call the floating dot enable method with rational of landscape which is basically a 16 rest to 9 aspect ratio similar to our video and that's all for this video if you all wanted a video for picture in picture for ios then let us know in the comments and a like on top of that will be appreciated thank you